Ah, okay guys, uh, welcome to the Jadjanix and to the financial modeling course. Today we are going to discuss a pension problem that is a bit complicated and for which we are going to use the solver problem in Excel, okay? Um, so uh, let's read the example and then we will go uh, to the Excel and uh, we will calculate our problem solution. Uh, a typical exercise follows okay you are 55 year olds and intend to retire at age 60 to make your retirement easier you intend to start a retirement account okay uh, at the beginning of each of year 0 1 2 3 up to 4 uh, 0 means today and 4 means the uh, end of the fifth year starting today and for each of the next four year you intend to make a deposit into the retirement account and uh, you think that the account will earn eight percent interest per year uh, after retirement at age 60 you anticipate living eight more years okay which means after eight years you will die but uh, sorry uh, it is just for the uh, example and for the understanding purpose we uh, I, I will pray for all of you to live uh, more than 60 years after your retirement, okay? During each of these years, you want to withdraw 30,000 from your retirement account, of course. Account balance will continue to earn 8%, okay? Now, the very first problem we have here and the very first mistake we commit here is that, uh, read the passage, uh, how much should you deposit annually in the account? Uh, the uh, following spreadsheet fragment shows how easily you can go wrong and this kind of problem in this case you have calculated that in order to provide 30,000 per year for eight years you intend to contribute uh, 2,400 divided by 5 which is equal to 48,000 in each of the first five years okay uh, as the spreadsheet shows you will end up with a lot of money at the end of the eight years the reason you have ignored the powerful effect of the compound interest and uh, if you set the interest rate in the spreadsheet equal to zero you will see that you are right but uh, in real time in in the question the interest rate is not equal to zero and that is the eight percent okay and i have wrote all this data here the eight percent interest rate and uh, let's assume for the time being that we will de deposit 48,000 uh, for the first five years in our account and after that for the eight years I will withdraw a uh, 30,000 from my account the objective is to make this balance the uh, balance of account at the end of the eighth period after retirement should be zero okay and uh, now you see uh, as I'm intended to contribute 48,000 for the first five years so I have uh, to write it in the table and I will construct this table and I will see this closing balance okay if it if is it is equivalent to zero then I'm okay and uh, the amount this 48,000 will be accurate and right one but if this amount the closing balance is not equal to zero which then uh, it will mean that 48,000 is wrong and I have to uh, calculate a very accurate amount okay and for that purpose we are going to use the solver tool of the excel sheet okay so this is the table and uh, it has plug-in formulas for everything we have to enter only two figures here the one here and the one here as i have calculated it before that's why everything is very easy and very clear i will show you all the formulas here and i will explain each and everything to you so uh, this is the year zero which means today and uh, today we don't have any balance our, uh, in our retirement account i haven't deposited any uh, amount of money before today in my account that's why the principal is zero today and uh, today i'm going to deposit 48,000 let's assume 48,000 but not 48 like this but i will make it equal to this one okay so 48,000 i will deposit today in my bank account and at the end of the period and in end of the first period you see i will have this closing balance in my account and this is because i have earned the interest okay uh, if you don't know how to calculate this interest let me calculate it for you here we have to take this one and this multiply it by the interest rate here and press enter you see now it's okay you calculated the interest 
payment and for here of course uh, if you want to uh, calculate the interest rate here the calculation will be a bit different different okay you have to type equal then parenthesis d5 this one plus this one parenthesis close and then multiply by the j2 which is the interest rate okay so you will find the interest rate okay if you want to see the formulas let me show you formula tax okay you can just double click and uh, right here press enter and you will see the formula there each and every excel has the formula and you can find it here like this okay okay so for the first five years i have deposited 48000 okay and uh, from the fifth sixth year onward uh, the consecutive eight year i am going to withdraw uh, 30000 this 30000 every year from my account okay so you see now i'm withdrawing uh, 30000 each year okay and you see after withdrawing my interest my interest earning is also decreasing my closing balance is also decreasing opening balance is decreasing but the most surprising thing is this one okay my account balance at the end of the year 10th after retirement is not zero they which means that these 48000 which i have deposited for the five years is not correct so uh, i have to find a correct figure of this 48000 for which i am going to use this solver option okay and if, if you want to use the solver you just click on this value sorry the cell reference in the value you type zero to say that it should be this cell should be equivalent to zero and here in this one by changing variable okay so you just click this one that you can change this one change this one and make the ending balance zero okay and now you click on the solve okay so it has solved the problem and if you want to keep it you can just click on the ok otherwise you can cancel it so i'm going to click on the ok you see my closing balance is zero now and uh, i have to deposit the right amount is 29800 sorry uh, 29386.55 dollar which i have to deposit for the first five years in my account and this account is earning eight percent interest so after the sixth year when i start to withdraw thirty thousand every year still the opening balance these opening balances will earn interest of eight percent and at the end of the eight period you see my account balance is zero okay if you want to see the formula uh, of this one this one everyone uh, you can just type equal formula tax and uh, you can calculate uh, sorry you can click this one if you want to see and uh, this one this one everyone where uh, which one you want to see okay so it was a bit um, about the solver and its function okay and we have uh, calculated our problem we have uh, solved our problem sorry we have found we found the right amount we have to deposit for five years in our account so it was a sim simple uh, description about the solver function and pension or retirement fund management okay if you like our video if you understand our methodology and you like it kindly share <coughs> like i'm sorry okay share so uh, like and subscribe to our channel okay guys thank you see you in next video bye bye